right, so as you can see, we're in the process of changing the coolant filter on the tow pig here. I wanted to do this video so you guys can see that these things actually do work. So this is after probably about 7,000 miles. You're definitely supposed to change it a little bit sooner, but uh, you know, so you can see all the crud that came out just from dumping it over. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna actually cut the filter open. That way we can see exactly um, the filter element to see if it's what's what's caught up in there so then we'll go ahead and throw the new one on all right so we got this really cool little filter cutter tool you can see you just tighten it around and then you can actually spin it around the filter so we're going to cut this some some gun out open it's almost like a giant brake line cutter Thing. you can see it just cuts the uh, top piece off Down in there. oh yeah oh yeah all oh, that crud All right, so as you guys just saw, um, between this pan and then opening up the oil or the coolant filter, you guys can see that coolant filters really do work. This is why I highly recommend them. I wanted to do this video so that you guys could see. This is my first one. So you're supposed to do it like 500 and then 1,000 and then every 5,000. Um, but we did the first one in like 7,000 miles. So this is where we're at here. Um, I'm telling you guys, it's totally worth it. You're gonna save your oil cooler if you still have it, like we do on this truck. It's gonna, you know, it's only filtering like 10%, but um, over time, it's gonna make a huge difference in cleaning up that that coolant um, passages and everything like that, and collecting all that sand and debris like I talked about when we installed the coolant filter. So, um, short video here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. We're gonna get the coolant top back off. I always recommend Red ELC for your coolant. Um, you guys can look it up on the forums and stuff. Everybody says red ELC is the way to go. So that's what we run to. Um, we're going to get it topped off and tow truck's good to go. So thank you guys for tuning in on today's video. Stay tuned. We got more coming for you guys. Well, not only for the tow pick, but also for the race truck. So stay tuned, subscribe, like, leave a comment down below. We'll catch you in the next video. Peace.